So I just wanted to touch base, man. It's like our first first week that legitly open, going into our second week. Shout out to my cousin behind the camera, man, Hezzy, man. I just wanted to me to speak so speak without feeling, speak without feeling, and like really like telling people. I mean, I appreciate all the love. Know what I mean, I appreciate all the love, the support from everybody. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't be coming here and being in my new gym for the support of people around the world, man. For buying my clothes, you know what I mean? For all the way from like Germany, all the way to. Africa, milling out stuff, you know what I'm saying? I just appreciate all the love, you know what I'm saying? And since I was a young young kid, man, I didn't even think like I'll be in this I'll be in this position to like touch people, man, like to even like to like show people my story. You know what I mean? When I first came and this had this plan to like basically show my talent and basically express how I feel about fitness, but express through fitness on how I could make an effect on people's life and impact on people's life just by telling my story and sharing it with them, you know what I mean? Cause like, it's just like coming from Albany, man. Small city, man, not super huge, you know what I mean? Crying right through the roof, you know what I mean? And, and seeing that day in, day out, football kind of, football directed me in a path that I would have never knew or never guessed, you know what I mean? And like, just like to see people that, that engage with me, see people that talk to me and show me that super, super, super genuine love, it means a lot, man, because not everybody is out there to see you in your best interest or, you know what I mean, to see you pushing and striving to be great, you know what I mean? I meet people every day, people come to the gym now every day, new people, new faces, and they just, and it's just off the genuine energy, you know what I mean? And I just wanted to just thank everybody, man. And we hit 50 members at the gym, and, I, and I just, it's just it's just amazing feeling, you know what I mean? It's amazing feeling. I grind 65, I didn't mean, know it was gonna be this big. And like, everybody's a part of it, man. If you come to the gym, if you sign the wall, all that stuff, I'm gonna show you the wall, we're gonna walk in in a minute. But like, everybody just showing the love, man, cause like, my mom, she sacrificed, you know what I mean? She had me super young. My stepdad coming to my life, he didn't have to have to like be a, a role model in my life. I mean, I was very stubborn at a certain age. I didn't want nobody to be in my life. And then once my once I used to go see my dad in prison and all that, it was just wasn't. I mean, I would have never, never in a thousand years. You know what I'm saying? Even statistically showing a man like me being raised and trying to and trying to make it right and be a prime example for a black man. It's huge, you know what I'm saying? And like people that's around me that sing, all my cousins, all my family members, all my friends from all different type of backgrounds, they wouldn't be around me if I wasn't the man I was today. You know what I mean? Like I'm not perfect at all. I try to do what I do and try to do it to the best of my ability. Cause I know tomorrow, I don't know if it's promise. I don't know if it's next day. You know what I mean? So you just gotta live in the moment. I love living in the moment. I love doing stuff to step out my comfort zone. Because if I didn't, I wouldn't be here today. You know what I mean? And it's just, it's just amazing feel like I grind 65, man, where dreams come true. And we gotta keep pushing it. We gotta keep pushing it, keep pushing it until the whole world feel my pain. You know what I mean? When I say feel my pain, I mean feel my story, understand the man I am. And I don't know how much bigger we're gonna get, but we're gonna keep driving until an eternity. You know what I mean? You feel me? So we're gonna go win. You know what I mean, baby? We're gonna go win. Has we gonna take a man, head? Mm -hmm. <laughs> We take a minute, man. I want to show y'all the wall. Right here, you see like this circle here. Circle here. This is before. You know I'm saying, I see the before, man. I'm super excited, man. Can't wait to get started on this project. So you're going to see in a little bit. I got my boys coming. Now nah, I mean, they about to come help me. They about to get started on this, you know what I mean? Look at my nigga real quick, bro. Look at my nigga working. Look at my nigga working. <laughs> Hey, my boy working over here. What's good? This boy working. Look at he working his feet. Oh yeah, they doing they doing this right here. Yeah, camera girls. 
Yeah. This boy got Chipotle, I'm dead. No, Sir! Yo! What's good, baby? Hey, you know what I'm saying? You come in here, clock in, show them the clock in here, clock in, hard work. You know what I mean? Coming in, you come into the gym. What's really popped out of this? I got six five logo on the wall, man. You know what I mean? You can sign anywhere on the wall that you want, baby. Every time I step in here, I look at the wall. I mean, I appreciate everybody that signed the wall, man. Every time I have somebody come sign the wall, I'm like, yo, sign it, do it with purpose. I mean, what motivates you? Like, what push you to go to the next day? Like, what's going to keep you driving to be great? Now, I mean, this is the wall right here. It means a lot to me because there's so many people from different backgrounds that's on this wall. And it's only going to get bigger. It's only going to get bigger. We're gonna keep driving, man. Let's appreciate everybody that supported the I Grind 65 team, the movement, the family, and the world. We're gonna fill it, man. We're gonna be around the world soon, man. Let's go! I'm breaking. That nigga's that nigga's still 